yeah, no, it was a typical derby go. The atmosphere was outstanding, and and also uh, I thought the, <laughs> the commitment from uh, both teams was strong. You know, there, but I've got a lot of respect for Wakefield. I thought we played really well today. One to seventeen were very strong. Well, I thought our forwards were very strong. And I, I like the way we're patient and we're very keen to build things. I, and I was really happy. Uh, just more so, probably defensive point of view. You know, we only conceded one try in the second half, and that was in the last dying minutes. And then we were, uh, had one just just before half time. And aside from that, we're very strong defensively and attacking wise. We're very organised. And our forwards uh, created some good momentum for us. It was a tough game for us tonight. I thought we played a very good Castle for side on the night, who uh, you know made us bring it out from our own end, you know, an awful lot during the game. Played some very smart football, completed really high, uh, and the kicking game were really good. You know, we felt uh, we felt in the first half we got some momentum in there, and you know, one or two ways we, we let that momentum slip. Um, but in the end, you know, we spent a lot of the time. Um, dropping out or bringing the ball from his own end, and, and Castleford, you know, defended very, very well, and, and we were kicking from deep, and, and they just dominated possession. And uh, Rangi Chase again pulling the strings, not just uh, putting in the try-scoring passes, but also building a lot of pressure down there, poking those kicks into the corners. Yeah, I think you've got to understand with Rangi. Um, you know, I thought his kicking game was very good, and so was Danny Orr's. I think I think his forwards laid some really good platforms for him. Uh, we put him into hooker in the, in the back end of the game. Uh, we, we deliberately wanted to do that. And I was very impressed the way he played there. He was very uh, hard to contain. He's, he's hard to contain at the best of times, but it just gave us a little bit of momentum around the ruck area. So, no, I, you know, it was very, very hard to, for, as a coach to uh, see any flaws in our game today. It was good. So is, is that something you're looking to do? Maybe bring Rangi into hooker a bit more often? Yeah, we have no issues with that. Rangi started his career in the NRL as a hooker and then branched out to... Uh, the standoff position and halfback position. Yeah, no, it will be, but we've got a really good young hooker in Milner. So, you know, look, we, we just want to be flexible. We don't have a big squad, so it's really important that we are we are multi-skilled and flexible. But uh, obviously, Rangi's a very talented player. I reckon you, you can play him anywhere and he'd be outstanding. Play him fullback, play him in the centres, wherever, he'd be good. I know you asked before the game for him to, to turn around from, from the last fixture. Yeah. Um, is that has that been a question again in there today? Well, I thought I thought we had a lot of improvements from from some players that we needed to improve. You know, I thought some of our front rowers in particular, um, you know, certainly aimed up a, a lot better in the middle of the field uh, than what they did last week. And I did think we had some individuals that tried very very hard for us tonight. Tried very hard. Um, you know, but collectively as a team, we, we're just a little bit off. Um, at the moment, and, I, and again, I'm not taking any, anything away from Castleford because I thought, you know, I thought on the night they were very good. And uh, it was a last last minute win against Hull KR, and a great performance here today. Is this where your season can really take off now and push push on towards the tail end? I thought we were a lot more dominant than scoreline defend said against. Uh, if you read the referee's report, uh, it said that two of their tries shouldn't have, shouldn't have been allowed, and it actually said we should have got seven penalties during the game, which we weren't given. So. If you put that in context, you know, I mean, I thought we were the better team against Hull KR. We, we, we led at half time and we led at the end of the game. So I just, uh, you know, I just really pleased we're going back to back with performances against here in a tough game.